For proper use, you must read and understand the instructions for use before starting work. Strictly respect its limitations and warnings. For further assistance, ask your safety supervisor or contact Draeger Safety. Qualitative fit testing using Bittrex solution using half masks shown here with the Draeger Explore 3300 series. The following contents will be included in the Bittrex fit testing kit. Fit test and sensitivity solution, two nebulizers, instructions for use, and one hood. Begin by buttoning the top two buttons at the top hood for increased stability. Next, empty the solutions into their respective nebulizers. Start with the sensitivity solution. First, crush the tube with the sensitivity solution. Ensure that the tip of the tube is pointing upward. Crush the tube until all the glass inside has been crushed and completely drain the tube into the nebulizer. There is already a hole inside of the tube to allow the liquid to come out. Do not attempt to cut the tube. Repeat for fit test solution. Remember, no eating, drinking, smoking, or chewing gum 15 minutes prior to the test. If the test solution can be tasted at any time, the test must be stopped. For Bittrex fit testing, particle filters must be used. The number of squeezes needed to detect the solution during the sensitivity test, 10, 20, or 30, will become the number of squeezes used in the actual fit testing, and during the test, every 30 seconds, half of that number, 5, 10, or 15 squeezes, will be administered. The employee should be medically certified to wear respiratory equipment and have already been trained on the proper use of the chosen equipment. The sensitivity test is conducted to ensure that the employee can detect, or taste, the test substance. This test is conducted with a nebulizer labeled Sensitivity Solution. Employee dons the hood without the mask, and the nebulizer is inserted into the hole in the hood. The employee will hold out the tongue during the sensitivity test. Sensitivity Solution is sprayed into the hood. Ten squeezes will be used to start. If the solution cannot be detected after 10 squeezes, then 10 more must be done. If the solution still cannot be detected, then 10 more. If after 30 squeezes the solution still cannot be detected, then the test must be stopped and another method, such as quantitative testing, must be used. Once the fit testing procedure has been explained, the user can don the mask and hood and begin with the required test exercises. In doing quantitative fit testing, seven rounds of exercises must be completed. Each exercise must be performed for 60 seconds. Normal breathing, deep breathing, Turning head side to side, moving head up and down, talking, rainbow passage, bending over or jogging in place, normal breathing. At the beginning of the test, the same number of squeezes needed to detect the solution in the sensitivity test will be administered, in this case, 10 squeezes. Every 30 seconds during the test thereafter, half of the initial squeezes will be administered, in this case, five squeezes. Normal breathing. Deep breathing. Turning head side to side. Moving head up and down. Talking. Rainbow passage.
bending over, or jogging in place. Normal breathing. If at any time during the fit test the taste of Bitrex is detected, if the test subject does not report tasting Bitrex, the test is passed. The conductor will wear the tested equipment. Properly dispose of any remaining fit test or sensitivity solution. Rinse out the nebulizers with warm water to prevent clogging. Wipe out the inside of the hood with a damp cloth to remove any deposited test solution. Quantitative fit testing. It can be so simple.